Hello and welcome to Martin Maths. We're doing some percentages with my guest presenters. They can help me find percentage of amounts. The first one here is 25% of 560. What do I do? Um, we do 25 over 100. Because that's what percent means. That is the same as a quarter. So we've got our equivalent fractions there. Uh, times 560. Times that by 560. So we've got that quarter of 560. And that equals to 140. Because if we were to do your bus stop or use your calculator, 560 divided by 4 would be 140. Excellent. Uh, the next question we've got is to use percentages, but not finding percentages of amounts. We're finding out what is the percentage. So say we've written a test and we've got 28 out of 40, and a student wants to know what their percentage is. What do I do there? So you have to times one by 100. Okay, so I want to so I want to find out what percentage that is. So I do 28 over 40 times by 100. Okay, again because it's percent. Yeah. You have to cancel um, the zero from 40 and 100. Because they both got uh, multiplied by 10, so I can cancel one factor of 10 there. Yes. Next, you should divide uh, 4 by 28. 28 by 4 because they've both. Uh, got factors of 4, so there's 1 4 there, and there's 7 4s there, so let's clean that up. I'm left with 7 times 10. Which equals to 70%. And there we go. So there we go, that's percentage of amounts and finding a percentage. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And goodbye from all. Bye. Bye.